Granbury, Texas. From Southern Charm to Bitcoin Nightmare. Granbury, Texas. A picturesque town nestled in the heart of the Lone Star State. It boasts a historic town square that tells tales of yesteryears and the sparkling waters of Lake Granbury that reflect the town's serene beauty. Life moved at a slower pace here. Neighbors knew each other by name and there was a strong sense of community. Kids played in the streets, their laughter echoing through the neighborhoods. But that tranquility has been shattered, replaced by an unsettling presence. A new resident moved in, a Bitcoin mining facility, bringing with it unforeseen consequences, and with it came a deafening roar. The peace that once defined Granbury is now a distant memory. The serene sounds of nature have been replaced by the constant hum of countless computer servers, working tirelessly day and night. This isn't just an annoyance, it's a health crisis. Residents are suffering from the relentless noise pollution. They are battling sleeplessness, anxiety, and a host of other health issues that have disrupted their daily lives. Their once peaceful haven has transformed into a battleground, where the fight for tranquility is ongoing. They are fighting for their health, their peace of mind, and their very way of life, hoping to reclaim the Granbury they once knew and loved. Sarah's Story, A Mother's Fight for Her Daughter's Health Sarah Rosencrantz is a mother on a mission, driven by an unyielding love and fierce determination. Her daughter Evelyn is trapped in a living nightmare, a reality that no child should have to endure. Diagnosed with autism and sensory processing disorder, Evelyn is acutely sensitive to sound, making everyday life a challenge. The constant noise from the nearby Bitcoin mine is unbearable for her, turning their home into a place of distress. It's like a jet engine running constantly, Sarah says, her voice filled with anguish. Evelyn is terrified. She can't sleep. She can't function. The noise is relentless, and it breaks my heart to see her suffer. Sarah has tried everything to help her daughter. Noise-canceling headphones, soundproofing their home. She has even considered moving, but it's not that simple. But the noise penetrates everything, seeping through walls and windows, leaving no escape. Evelyn's story is not unique in Granbury. Many families are facing similar battles. Countless residents are experiencing similar suffering, their lives disrupted by the incessant noise. Their stories are a testament to the devastating impact of noise pollution on health and well-being highlighting a community in distress and in desperate need of change. The Town Hall, Voices of Distress and Desperation The Granbury Town Hall meeting was packed to the brim. Residents, their faces etched with worry and frustration, filled every seat available, leaving no room to spare. They were there to voice their concerns about the Bitcoin mine that had recently started operations in their community. And they didn't hold back, expressing their fears and frustrations openly. I haven't had a good night's sleep since that thing started operating," one man exclaimed, his voice shaking with anger. It's driving me crazy, the constant noise is unbearable. A young mother shared her heartbreak, her voice trembling with emotion. My baby cries all night long, she said, tears streaming down her face. The noise is relentless and it's affecting her health. The noise is just too much for her and it's breaking my heart to see her suffer. Story after story poured out from the residents, each one filled with pain and desperation, each one more harrowing than the last, painting a grim picture of their daily lives. The message was clear. The Bitcoin mine was destroying their lives, and they couldn't take it any longer. And they were demanding action, pleading with the authorities to do something before it was too late. Section 4. The Silent Killer Dr. Salim Balu, an expert on noise pollution and its effects on human health, listened intently to the residents' testimonies. He knew their suffering was real. Noise pollution is often called the silent killer because its effects are not always immediately apparent. Prolonged exposure to noise pollution can have serious consequences. It can lead to sleep disturbances, cardiovascular disease, cognitive impairment, and even increased risk of stroke. Dr. Balu's words sent a chill through the room. The residents were not just imagining things, their health was truly at risk. The Bitcoin mine wasn't just a nuisance, it was a public health hazard. Section 5. Bitdeer. The source of all this misery is a company called Bitdeer. They operate a massive Bitcoin mining facility on the outskirts of Granbury. Bitcoin mining is an energy-intensive process. It requires powerful computers running around the clock to solve complex mathematical equations. These computers generate an immense amount of heat, so they require industrial-sized cooling fans to prevent them from overheating. 
These fans are the culprit behind the unbearable noise. Bitdeer's facility is in clear violation of local noise ordinances. But the company seems unfazed. They argue that they are bringing jobs and investment to the area. But at what cost? The residents of Granbury are paying the price with their health and their peace of mind.